get your hair. Is this a profession? I mean, that's kind of rude, honestly. I mean, I know we're in college, but do we take this seriously? Yeah, we really do. Is this just a bunch of guys just hanging out, just yelling at a basketball game? Absolutely not. Sometimes Ben talks in questions. Are we messing around here? No. No. Sherry Cole went to Oklahoma Christian, and now she's the head basketball coach of the OU women's team? Like, our alumni, the head coach of an OU women's basketball team? That's amazing! Yeah, so Caleb, he's, you, when you're in a crowd, you're like, oh man, he's so loud, he's so into it. But then you go to like the library, and you're trying to do homework, and he's still screaming at you. It's like you're getting a lecture. He's super angry at you, just yelling at you all the time. Yeah, I have no idea Caleb does that. He's just... Hey, can you guys uh, take off the scarves? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. Yeah, he just talks so loud all the time. It's, uh, it's pretty crazy. Yeah, I heard uh, he used to blow things up. Or maybe he used toothpicks instead of Q-tips to clean out all the wax in his ears. Yikes. She chartered two buses for us to go to the big game, so that's why we're going. Why not? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh man, I'm excited. No, 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 I'm excited. No, I'm excited. <laughs> whatever, whatever. This is a huge game for us. Oh man, we're going up against Duke. <laughs> Let's be honest, you know, I'm just here to have a good time. I mean, you know, it's really not my thing, you know, but I'm here to enjoy it. You know, Sherry, she hooked us up with Cheetos and Mountain Dew, so rock on. Of course you have to be serious. This is a game day. I mean, gotta work on your breathing. <sighs> gotta stay calm. Sherry made a video for us, but I'm not sure what it is. Hey guys, do you have any idea how much I appreciate you? Thank you so much for loading up and heading down south to the Lloyd Noble Center today. We're about to have some fun for a couple of hours. I want you to know that the reason I really came up with this idea was uh, I went to our men's game at the field house and you guys were playing and your student section was there and you could feel the passion and I watched it and I thought, what a special culture that place still has. It took me right back to 20 years ago when I was playing in the nest and the way we always felt protected and encouraged and enveloped by our student body and that's special. You guys get it and I want my kids to have an opportunity to feel that culture, that environment that you guys create, and I want you to have a great time today at the Lloyd Noble Center. Please know that what you have is very special. Man, apparently we have something real special. Yeah. I root every for the Sooners. All right, all right. I root every for the Sooners. We were going through some cheers on the bus, because obviously OU cheers are going to be a little bit different than the cheers we do at Oklahoma Christian, but I'm not worried. excited for today. I mean, it's a big deal that Sherry Cole invited us out here. Uh, I mean, we do this all the time. Uh, we made our presence known at their home game, and I think we're all excited. It's a big deal. Um, we're we're going to go big. You know, we, we always go big. I think we're going to go home. Um, but we're not going to go home because we didn't go big. We're, we're going to go home because we have to after the game. <laughs> This is 
what I wear. Sherry Cole! Sherry Cole! Sherry Cole! Here she comes. Here she comes. Here she comes. Yeah, she's great. I think it's going to be a really good game. I'm really excited. What is it exactly? Yeah, that's an important question to answer. And everyone calls it different things. I like to call it crowd cheering. Because here's the deal. We could call it cheerleading, but we're no cheerleaders. You won't ever see me in a pleated skirt. But here's the deal, okay? We are leading chants. And we're in the crowd. We're not out to the side dancing or something like that. But here's the thing, man. We're in the crowd, but we're bigger than it. We're leading, but we're there. Am I saying you have to be a genius to do this kind of stuff? <laughs> yes. Am I a big deal? Yeah. Yeah, I am. Am I going to ask you another question that I'm probably answering myself? Yes. Yes, I am. Pretty much. <laughs> do I think I'm the best? No, not necessarily. But is this kids play out here? No. No, this is highbrow stuff. Let's get this place rocking. You know what to do to the Caleb got into this because this is important. This is a lifestyle. This is enthusiastic spectatorship. We don't just let anybody join. I mean, you gotta be committed. And we're committed. We really don't have anybody that doesn't go all out. No. Caleb is not a cheerleader. Caleb is a team member. Caleb is a professional. Caleb is an enthusiastic spectator. Get that right. Yeah, sometimes I call Ben sweet potatoes. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, that's really odd. I have no clue where that came from. How did you come up with that? Honestly, there's no real reason. It's not weird or anything. Yeah, it's weird. <laughs> Random angry yelling is one of those things that crowd cheering crews just do. I mean, it's never personal, but when something happens and you have to make a message known to both the fans and the team and the refs, well, there's not really a better way to do it than that. And I mean, we're not actually mad. But, that's just how it is. Let's go, oh you! Let's go, oh you! It is all about experience. But at some point, you gotta jump in and just start. You know, not all of us started at the top, but we worked at it, and it takes this talent that's inside you. You have to have it, or you can't be an enthusiastic spectator. Does that make sense? Let me answer your question with another question. What is originality? Sometimes it's not just the words that you're yelling so loud. It's the energy. Oh man, I love that cheer. I don't know who came up with it. It's gotta be like super old, but it's one of my favorites. Definitely a gem. The one? Technically, it's for the one Oklahoma. 
I consider it more like we're number one or the best team or I like pointing my finger. You pick. Hey, Duke, should you take her out to dinner first before you foul her like that? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> like a steak dinner. <laughs> like a really nice dinner, right? <laughs> like, any, you might even, like, go see a movie or something. <laughs> I can't just, like, yeah, maybe, like, walk a dog in a park. <laughs> I don't even, it's... <laughs> How many questions have I asked today? Can I answer that for you? Can I answer that with a question? Will I ever say another statement again? I think I will. Look, Josh can mock me all he wants, but do I talk like that? No. I mean, I like the guy, I really do. It's just kind of a weird way to talk. Maybe what bugs me the most is that he asks the question and then he answers it himself. I mean, if I did, wouldn't other people notice? Yes. Yes, they would. It's not supposed to end with fun. Fundamentals. All of it. Whole thing. Are you demental? So, two cheers. Offensive cheers and defensive cheers. Offensive cheers, our team has the ball. We're not trying to be offensive, like offensive, but we're trying to be on our offensive cheers. Where we're going, we have the ball, we're distracting the other team, and you know, we make the three points, and yeah, we're good, yeah, 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 take that other team. When we go to the defensive cheers, it's kind of the exact same thing, except we're on defense now. We're always trying to come up with new cheers and tailor each cheer or, or experience to each game that we're at. Um, sometimes we think we should pick on different players in the team for where they're from or different things like that. Uh, sometimes different situations call for different cheers and different uh, creative nature. And here, even at the Duke game, I mean, we, we are uh, tailoring some of our very famous cheers. We're going to beat the sin out of you. We're going to say we're going to beat the Duke out of you just to be humorous and, 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 and tailor it for this game. I'll try not to overthink it, but if you over-exaggerate the potential that you're going to beat this team with your mathematical, systematic approach, then you're wrong. I mean, let's be serious. You can't do it. There's no way. I mean, you can try to come up with a plan and some type of formula that you're going to think maybe it's a song. Maybe it's singing Old McDonald How to Farm. It doesn't work. These are skilled basketball players. I mean, they know what they're doing. I mean, they're great at it. That's why they're playing basketball. But, I mean, they overthink it too much. Sometimes they'll miss it. Sometimes they won't. I mean, let's be real. If they have a good follow-through, it's probably going in no matter what you're cheering. So, I mean, that's just me. And I mean, let's be real. Huh? Defense! 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 You did it! You did it! You know you did it! Don't cheat it! You got the Yeah, you know, somebody started that cheer, and I wasn't super happy with them, because, I mean, it's one of those special cheers that we don't pull out all the time. <laughs> I mean, am I in charge around here? Yes. Yes, I am. Yeah, people ask me how I get so loud. Look, this is the real thing. This ain't the Girl Scouts, all right? No, 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 Dave is awesome to have in the crew. Because here's the thing, he's really mellow outside of the game, but as soon as you put him on those bleachers, he loses his mind. He's completely fantastic out there. He's not replaceable. I mean, 
the Girl Scouts are okay and everything. I mean, I love the Girl Scouts. They have great cookies. They look cute in their little dresses. But uh, look, I'm not a girl. I'm an adult. <laughs> When I cheer, I like to do a lot of finger work. I don't know what it is, but when I cheer, my fingers just come alive and start cheering little chants of their own. I mean, it works for him, right? Sherry Cole, I mean, she's kind of a big deal. She's at OU for a reason. Mad respect. Mad respect? How about... No, that's good. Dwayne doesn't seem like he's into it today. I mean, he really needs to get his head in the game. Go, Sue, go, go. Everyone looks like that sometimes. I mean, there's a time to cheer, and then there's a time to be quiet. But I guess you didn't get me on camera for any of that, did you? No, I didn't think so. The bounce, bounce, woo, woo cheer, I mean, it's not typical for us or for gaming purposes in general. The idea here usually is you do a chant or a song that you can continuously do like that. This one is based on the actions of the player. And so we're at the mercy of them bouncing, passing, wooing, going, things like that. But it's really against the rules of chanting. It's kind of revolutionary, if you will. Here's the thing, I really like this cheer because sometimes uh, you'll go into a gym and everyone's yelling at the refs. Guess what, buddy? They're not going to make any calls for you because they're mad at them. They've heard that a billion times before. So we try to do something a little bit different. We get a little bit courteous. That's not oxymoronic. Could you speak up? That's not oxymoronic. <laughs> You know, it might not be Christmas time, but we're gonna still sing Jingle Bells anytime you can have a themed cheer. It's a great cheer. Yeah, that's right. You take a seat. So, what we're trying to do here is to encourage or urge our team to get the ball back from the opposing team. Yeah, sometimes he does that, just... I don't get it. If you're gonna be loud, just be loud and be excited about it, don't... 
mean, I don't, I don't know. I don't know why. I mean, it's just, I mean, you want to be angry in professional spectatorship, but I mean, you just, there's a line and you can't cross that line. I mean, sometimes I get a little too into it, maybe. Do I? But I mean, that's just, I don't want to step on anybody's toes. You know, I don't want to offend on anybody. Yeah, you know, he does that a lot. I mean, am I saying he shouldn't be here today? No. But am I saying that maybe he hurt us a little bit more than he helped us? Maybe. Ben said that about me? Well, Ben can... Can you second guess yourself when you crouch here? No. Although, now that I think about it. <laughs> Caleb doesn't know why Todd and Davis go to the games. I mean, they're not really part of our section. Just look at those two. They're a little bit odd. Well, he's kind of like trying to dumb us down, you know? We're not part of the theme, but... It's all about enthusiastic spectatorship. Next level stuff, you know? Yeah. I mean, down below, they didn't have enough seats down there, so yeah. we went up to the next level. I mean... Yep. Bright green scarves, you know. Yeah. We just go all out. And all out every game. Every game. That's what that's what we do. Yep. It's our style. No need to change it. Caleb, not a fan. Who'd they even come with? Not us. <laughs> yeah. That didn't really work. But you know, sometimes I like to break the silence with a bark and occasionally it works and sometimes it doesn't, you know. Uh, most of the time I like to use a chihuahua, like more of a high-pitched thing where people are like, whoa, what just happened, you know, kind of like that. Occasionally a pit bull works, you know, kind of throw them off with a deep growl. Um, but yeah, this time it kind of fell through. I don't know, is it weird to, to bark like a dog? Yeah, most of the time the chihuahua thing works, but you should hear his Doberman. Yeah, we're sticking around because Sherry Cole wants her picture taken with us. Sherry Cole wants her picture taken with us. That's what cheering is all about. Man, all of us supporting her school. All of us singing the Oklahoma Christian University song. Singing that song, seeing Sherry there, the look in her eyes, seeing all of us banded together, singing with her. Man, what an experience. It was awesome. Wow. Sherry Cole. I don't even know how to begin. Stop. 
get louder. Overall, it was a good day. Yeah, it's pretty cool out there. I mean, you got Bruno Mars the Super Bowl, Miracle on Ice, today. It's about as busy as it gets. It's about all we got. Maybe the moon landing. That might be there too. Yeah, you know, we had a good time and we did our part. Thanks for having us, Sherry. Are we good?